previously on Dungeons and Dragons. Our heroes jumped out and surprised the gun elf and very nonly failing knocked him out. Alura noticed what had happened. But said fuck that I'm not healing that thing. So instead Duke got himself a test subject to research the biology of gun elves. However, that was when our heroes began hearing more footsteps coming down the stairs. Unfortunately for him, our heroes did not make even the faintest of sounds as they viciously and nonly failing knocked him out too. To stop the other pirates that would inevitably follow. Chad ran up into the next room taking a seat with a bullet disguised as the now definitely just knocked out pirate closely behind him as Alura hid the evidence. Unfortunately, two of the pirates recognized Chad from the beach. However, the luck gods desperately wanted our heroes to win as Bullant managed to convince the third pirate the other two were insane. With the combined power of Bullant using the present bombs he looted from the not dead body of the pirate and that fact that it was now three against two, our heroes made short work of the pirates. Which suddenly became two against one. Meanwhile in the other room, Duke began his very ethical research. Once our heroes regrouped and with the pirates who knew about the path to the elevator all dead, Duke magically created an illusion to make the doorway look like a wall. Our heroes then had a very relaxing wait as none of the pirates could find them through the illusion and bug swarms. Eventually, everyone had made their escape except for Alura, Bullet, Chad, and Duke. Alura and Duke took the elevator down normally and then Chad and Bullant destroyed it so no one could follow. They then both floated down the elevator shaft thanks to the Featherfall Ring. As our heroes made their escape back through the mine, our heroes had a chance to reflect on their abilities. Duke used his new knowledge of gun elves to put together all the necessary spells for hog wrestling. Bullant decided missing is overrated. Alura completed her mail and courses for Wizard College. And Chad decided dying sucks so he'll just live forever. <laughs>